This is Made Up Shaheer back at it again with another YouTube video and today I have with me my gorgeous model Farwa Shahid. I did this super sultry Arabic style makeup look on her and what do you feel about it? I actually love it. She actually loves it you all and so do I. So if you want to see how I created this look then please keep on watching. Yep. So you guys, I always start my makeup application with a water cream and here I'm using Drink of Age 2 by Tarte and then I'm moisturizing further using the Holy Grail Elixir. This is a really nice moisturizing um, oil and then I'm also going to prep the under eyes using the under eye glory by Saffron Natural. This is a great duo for prepping the skin. Now I am concealing some of her darkness um, using the shade light medium honey by Tarte. This is the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and then blending it out with a sponge and that's what we have. Um, and then I'm applying the Dior Backstage Foundation, which is a really nice light to medium coverage foundation. And I really prefer using like concealer first and then a light foundation because it gives a better finish. And now I'm bronzing using the shade light from Huda Beauty Tantor range. I really love these products for bronzing and contouring, like they're a very neutral tone. So they work for both. And now concealing and highlighting using the shades light medium and fair in the dark shape tape range blending them out with a beautiful Bahamna sponge and then baking using the shade sugar cookie so her skin is pretty combination which is why I'm baking a little bit and applying um, the brow waves on her brows this is the shade ebony and concealing using the P. Louise base on a flat brush so we're going to be using the Huda Beauty new nude palette uh, for this look and I'm applying the shades that I showed in the video I don't know the names now um, on the outer corner building some dimension and then applying these two shimmer shades with the beautiful by Amna flat brush love this brush for um, applying shimmers and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take an Anastasia black eye pencil and basically just line the top lash line and wing it out a little bit And then I'm going to basically smudge it out and just smoke it out using the shade Mulberry and Noir from Soft Glam Palette. And I'm going to do the same on the lower lash line and then wing it out a little bit as well as shown in the video. And then taking the shade Gold Digger from the Melted Shadows um, by Huda Beauty in the inner corner and applying some Krylon TV Paint Stick in the waterline. And then that's it for the eye look using the Lottie Tomlinson lashes from Huda and this blush from Lorac. This is their Teak Parade palette. And spritzing the face with Sandalwood Rose Luminizer by Famulosh. And I'm gonna highlight using the Peach Fizz and Vegas Loose Highlighters by Anastasia. Absolutely love these products. They're so nice, so skin-like and amazing. Applying the shade Sidra by um, Zephyde and then the Fenty Beauty um, Diamond Lip Gloss, the universal one, I don't know the name, but you know what I'm talking about. And spreading the face with Fix Plus and that's the final look. Alright guys, so that was the video. Let us know what you think about it and I would actually like to thank the most these two people for making this video happen. This is Farwa, the gorgeous model and the photographer and videographer. Um, please introduce yourself guys. Uh, I'm Farwa Shahid, I'm makeup artist. Please do follow me on Instagram. My Instagram handle is farwa.shahid. And I'm Mariam Rizvi and you can follow me at Mariam Rizvi Productions on Facebook and Instagram. And she's an amazing photographer and videographer. I love her work. She was amazing and you guys need to check up on them and follow them. And inshallah, Thank you. I'll no problem at all and inshallah I'll see you guys next week. Bye bye! bye.